hard out there. Whew. I am soaking wet, but it was totally worth it because guess what we got in the mail today, guys? We got our May Mystery Tackle Box. This is going to be freaking awesome. But anyway, guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you all are having a great day today. So, guys, like I said, we have May Mystery Tackle Box. I wonder what is inside. Let me get my knife. Where is my knife? There's my knife. Alrighty. To cut this bad boy open. There we go. Alright, so let's see what is inside this month, y'all. Alright, first thing first. We got our awesome sticker for this month. For when you're out there fishing, you think you hooked the most gigantic bass ever when it's actually... It's a tree pounder, guys. <laughs> Love that sticker. That's probably going to go on the back of the Jeep. First bait up, guys. First thing I absolutely first see is right here. The Strike Pro Tournament Grade. Looks like a crankbait. What is this? The Cranky XSS 75F. Depth 0 to 3 feet. Check it. Look how good that one looks, guys. That is a really, really sick bait. It has like that really nice chrome look to it. A little blue on the gills. Really, really nice. Dive zero to three feet, so it's a very shallow, very nice size, very versatile square bill crankbait, it looks like. So that is really, really awesome. Next thing in the box is Optimum Baits. This is a weighted, well, actually, it's a whole swim bait. Check it, guys. It is a whole swim bait. It's like a little minnow right there. Really, really nice. It is... It's a 5 8 ounce cam. It's a chameleon color. Hold on, let me just open this. Where's that knife at again? Let me just open this, guys. Let me take a look. Let's see. Because it looks good. It really does look good. I like it. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. They used a uh, really, really good plastic there. There's a better look at it. If y'all can see it. Oh, okay. There you go. Yeah, you can see it. That's a better look at the bait. It's really nice. Very small. Very, very small bait, but uh, you know what? If you're in a pinch and there are some uh, schooling bass out there eating some shad, toss that bad boy out there, be good to go. All right, next thing I see is 1,000 fish, 10,000 fish, the cycle bait. Heard a lot about this. A lot of people started fishing this here recently, saying it's a really good bait as long as you have a really good trailer. A lot of people will uh, say that the Yodo worm goes really good on the back of this because of the little shaking action. But uh, let's see what it says. The cycle bait, the cycle bait is a new Patented wire bait with the erratic action like nothing you've seen before. Ooh, that does sound good. It's weird. It has like these chains that connect it. Can y'all see up there? Yeah, like those two ring chains. Little, little strange for a, uh, you know, for that. But, uh, you know, it's 3 8 ounce. It has the willow blade, you know. Has a peanut butter and jelly color, so it looks good. But, uh, you know what? I guess this is just one of those baits you're just going to have to try and find out for yourself. Uh, really nothing to say about my first look at that. But the next thing we have is is the Kalins. It's the Sunny 3.8 inch Tickle Tail. Tick, tickle Tail, what? Okay, so the first thing about these baits, guys, is this is the package. Now, these are Paddle Tail Swim Baits, don't get me wrong, but here's the kicker. Let's, I gotta show y'all what these things look like. They're crazy, like little aliens. And I have no idea how this would affect it in the water. But look at that. Look, check it. It's got little tiny pincers right there. All along the body on both sides, little things. So I'm wondering when if it's in the water, if they do like the wave thing or they just tickle out. I mean, that is, that thing's just crazy looking. Just crazy. Ugh. But you get a lot in the package. I think, yeah, you get eight in the pack. And that's really cool. These make really, really cool trailers for stuff, you know, like crankbait. Uh, not crankbaits. What am I saying? They just make really good trailers, okay? We'll cut that part out. But they'll make really, really good trailers. And that is the uh, the Sunny. These are called the Tickle Tails. Yep. Right there. These are the Tickle Tails by Callan. Interesting baits. I gotta say, that is probably the most interesting bait out of the box so far. The next up, we have some more bruiser baits. These are the stickworm smoke black blue flake. Ooh, I like blue flake. Check it, guys, right there. Y'all really can't see it that great in the package, but they're they're like translucent, almost like clear with this like a smoky blue. Here, can y'all see it now? Is that a better, better shot? Yeah, that's a little bit better. Yeah, you see that smoky blue, almost see through. 
looks really, 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 really good, really flexible. You know how one way you can check to see if uh, your worms are really good? You just do that back and forth really, really hard. And if it doesn't come apart, it's a usually a pretty good bait. Now, it might tear when a hook goes through it, but that's a different story. But a very good, versatile bait, very durable, really good bending action, very flexible, good, good amount of weight to it if you want to do weightless. So all in all, a really good Cinco. So that is from Bruiser Baits. These are the stick worms. You get seven in the pack. Not too bad. You can never have enough worms. I don't care who you are. No matter what you say, you can never have enough Cinco's. And most of the time, it really doesn't even matter what brand they are. Cinco's will all do the same. Okay, now this is another weird bait. This is, okay, I'm going to butcher this name, so forgive me on that. It's called Fishui, Fish, Fish, Fishui Lures. And it says, I'd hit that. Okay, just, you can't make this stuff up, guys. Look, Fishui, and I don't know if y'all can see right here where it says it, I'd hit that. Yeah. But anyway, these are, uh, what does it say this even bait is? It doesn't say what the bait is. There's no name of the bait, even on the back, it's just their motto. Doesn't say what the bait is, so that's just crazy, but it's a worm, but check it out, it's like a slim tail worm. Right there. Y'all see that, if it'll focus? Yeah, look, it's like a slim tail worm, that's crazy crazy now one thing i've been having a lot of luck with if y'all watch any of my videos is uh the shaky head the shaky head rig has been what's catching them for here after the post spawn and everything so this looks like it could be really really good on a shaky head with that that slim tail just doing this in the water come on if you're a bass and you saw this you'd eat that up don't even lie but yeah fishy lures that is a strange strange bait but I think it'd catch fish. I really do. I think if you used it right, like it says on the back, uh, Texas rig, weightless, Carolina, shaky head, drop shot, Nico, all the ways to use this, whatever this is, it's really, really cool. So I think I will definitely be using that because that would be awesome. And what else is in the box? Oh, come on. If y'all, if y'all are subscribed to Mr. Tack Box, I'm pretty sure you can already guess what comes in every box. It is guaranteed in every box. And I don't know why, but it, you know, it comes in handy. And that is the Harmony Hooks. <laughs> there is a pack of Harmony Hooks in every Mystery Tackle Box. And if you don't get Harmony Hooks in your Mystery Tackle Box, well, I don't know. Because they've came in almost every single one of mine. I'm not complaining. Can never have too many hooks. But you get one in every single box, which is awesome. But guys, that is it for the May 2021 Mystery Tackle Box. We had the Fishery Lures. We had these really crazy uh, Catlin's 3.8 Tickle Tail Paddle Tail Swim Baits. Guys, these are these are just crazy. I am gonna have to do an underwater video and so y'all can see what these guys look like because that is just really, really cool. Really, really cool. And of course, we have some Bruiser Baits. I really, I'm really starting to like these this bait company, Bruiser Baits. They've sent a bunch of their baits in these boxes. I've gotten Creature Baits, I've gotten Senkos gotten so many different types of soft plastics from this company and all of them have really really good action and for the most part they're really really durable so if y'all don't know anything about bruiser baits go check them out uh tackle warehouse mr tackle box for sure really really good baits thank you so much for watching today i really hope you enjoyed the video because i really enjoyed making it because i couldn't go out fishing today because the weather in texas is being bipolar again see this is why i can't go fishing because it's raining it's been raining for a month it's been raining for about a month straight it feels like the fishing has been very slow because everything's flooded but anyway that's neither here nor there guys i really hope you enjoyed the video if you haven't already please make sure to like subscribe to the dark relaxing channel hit that big notification bell down there for me hit that thumbs up guys i love y'all y'all keep it real i'll catch y'all on the next one guys peace